and then the ghost appeared and it was a headless woman and it really freaked me out oh hi guys what's up this is the awesome nerd show back again playing on arc survival evolved here on the ragnarok server and i'm just in here telling little ghost stories until you came and interrupted me so thanks for that um but i'm just here in my house of course in my upgraded house sitting by the fireplace um so today we're gonna be doing some stuff going on in adventure but uh so first off from last time here's what are the generators i put up don't have anything inside yet i may build a little barrier around this place too just kind of like the enclose it in just as a little shelter but i don't have a refrigerator or anything oh look for the rg there it is so we're here today and so here's my workshop from last time still got everything set up and cooking in here get metal cooked up and everything not nearly as much as i thought i'd gathered but it's still at least 200 in each furnace um and a couple more in others so got all that got the generator going got the um fabricator set up there and everything but today it is taming day and i was trying to figure out what should i tame like what's priority and i think today the priority is um a uh, frog I couldn't think of what it's called a frog so we gotta go to the swamp which I believe would be in this direction I believe is the swamp over that way and then I want an anklo too which I was thinking you know to get uh, metal and everything oh what am I doing uh, what it what's going on I don't know is this just I can't tell if there's something wrong with the game am I in K mode oh maybe I was in K mode maybe I don't know I was so confused for a second there we go now we're back into normal mode so i need a frog and then i want to find an anklo which i don't know where anklos are but i do know where frogs are so we can fly over towards start heading this way towards i'm pretty sure the swamps this way and i was really wanting to get a water dino and keep it in here but i'm pretty sure there's no outlet except for unless there's dinos already in here but i'm pretty sure there's no outlet i haven't flown that way to see but i'm pretty sure over this way there's no drops anywhere nope I'm um, pretty sure this way it's um, like there's a waterfall and everything so I won't be able to get a dino in here which is kind of disappointing I was like I, said, I was hoping to get you know like a shark and stuff um, dinos like that and just bring it into here but because like I said there's a waterfall and stuff I'm pretty sure I'll see it when I fly over this way but so I won't be able to do it the only thing I can get is probably a spino just something that can go on land and water as well so i may get that and just uh taint uh barrier off barrier off an area down there by the water that of course has all the dinosaurs so much like skeletons and stuff down here and do all that but of course as i mentioned first i'm going to fly over to the swamp and i'm going to do a frog first because frogs should be pretty easy i got arrows crafted up and i believe i have um some uh foundations and stuff to be able to build a little taming pin if i need to that i can pick up and carry with me that I can maybe use also for the anklo and everything just kind of uh just to use that to help cut stuff off i'm going to just fly through here just to see exactly where the water does go so i know if i'll be able to use it or not but um so i will see when i get to the swamp and i find a frog worth taming because i need that sweet sweet cementing paste and i need to kill all the bugs in the world so i will see you when i find something Okay, so I found a 145 frog over there, which I think it is probably going to be um, pretty much as good as I can get. So I'll go ahead and just start putting down all this stuff so I can tame it over here because there is a ton of dangerous stuff around. Like, of course, bugs already everywhere that are attacking me all over the place. There's Baryonyx right over there that I'm worried about coming up and attacking me. Okay, I think we should be good for a second now. So let's go ahead and place all of these foundations. Place the door. I'll probably just put it uh, right here, maybe. Come on, just place somewhere for me. There we go. Now let's get the walls up. Should I remember this? doors go at the bottom and then the, these walls up top and then like I said I'll just pick these up every time I'm done using them I didn't do it over at the beaver hut just because I forgot about it and I was like I could have go win pick those up let's go ahead and put the 
Yeah, make sure I actually crafted a behemoth gate one when I did it earlier on accident. Okay. So let's go ahead and switch this to manual. Um, switch to manual. And we'll close it because I don't want it getting out. And let's go pick up our frog. So the frog should be over here. Hopefully it's not dead because there's a lot of stuff fighting over here as you can see. But it is a green frog. Hopefully it's not this green frog. Nope. Um, it was over on this land area. Shoot, I'm probably going to have to find it now. Um, let's see if I can pick up the frog. Which, I know this isn't it. Yeah, that's the 50. There was a 50 and a 145 over here. So it looks like the frog and the sarco aren't fighting. Is this it? Ooh, a 150. This is even better. Oh, that's so cool. Thought I had something and got something even better. So we have a perfect frog right here. This is awesome to start off the day, so let's go ahead and drop it in. And I'll go ahead and kill all this stuff, the Capro and the Sarko over here, so we don't have to worry about that affecting us. Hopefully the frog goes in the box, which it looks like it is. Where is the... I think I keep calling the Capro. I think this is a Baryonyx. Yep, Baryonyx. I've never seen one of those before. Or I've seen them before, I've just never like tamed one or anything. Let's get the Sarko over here. bring it to us right here. Ooh, that was a really good Sarko too. Oh well. Um, so let's come over here. I think that's everything super dangerous in the area. I don't see... Oh, that's a flower or a leaf. Okay, so we should be good now. Hopefully I got the bird on neutral so it should be able to help. Nope, that's the wrong thing. Now let's tame this frog again. And I got a saddle already crafted for both the um, this and the anklo. I checked, yeah, this one I had to craft the anklo. I already, or no, it was this. I think I have a really good saddle for. Oh no, it was the anklo. I'm so confused. One of them I already had a got a saddle from a drop that was, you know, a better saddle than primitive. So that's super awesome. I just gotta knock this froggy out. Froggy go sleep. Froggy go sleep. Quit doing your tongue. Blup, blup, blup. Oops, I missed. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. <gasps> Is it down? Unconscious. Awesome. Oh, I need to get uh, stuff for it, though. Give me your meat. I don't know if Baryonyx. Oh, I do. Go and grab a bunch of that, and then a couple stacks of that meat. Come on, get in there. And we'll put the prime meat in. Hopefully it'll eat that first. Awesome, awesome. And now we just let it tame up. Be cool if I can pick up my dart that I missed back. Uh, let's go ahead and cut this tree down right here. There we go, so that way it's out of the walkway. Awesome. Let's see. So I will let the front. Oh, look, one bite and it's already that much. Oh, it's. Did I shoot it after it went down? I must have shot it. Dang it. Oh, well, it's not going to be too bad. It's still almost a perfect. I mean, it was a 150. But dang, I can't. I'm pretty sure I shot it when it went down. But I'll fit, let, fit this, ugh, let this finish taming up. And we'll be right back. And then we'll kind of hop around and get some bugs while we're right here. So I'll see you when it's done. And it tamed up, and of course it just ate one more piece of food and it got tamed up. So we have, yeah, it was the ankle saddle that I have. So we have the Bezel Buffle saddle to put on there. And we've got our frog now. Awesome. So let's open this up. Pop off the frog. Of course we need to pick all this stuff up. Let's go ahead and pull out our gun. Be able to pick everything up. And I'm hoping we don't... Hopping around here, we don't get attacked by the things that take you off your saddle because that's what I'm worried about. So let's go ahead and pick this up and the door frame and all of this stuff. Of course, we'll probably be back over here at some point to get more dinos that you find over in the swampish area. But it didn't take hard to find. Like I said, I had a 145 that I wanted was going to tame, but then I saw this one, a 150. And so I was like, oh, that's perfect. 
Let's see, do we got any bugs anywhere? I just had a whole bunch of bugs. Ooh, there's say a bunch that were attacking me. Maybe I can find all their skeletons. I only found the one. Come on. More please. What level's this frog? I'll kill a frog. Maybe that'll draw some bugs in. There's a 135. I'll leave that one for now. Um, let's go up in the land here. Ooh, there's a snake. Let's kill this. Oh my god, what level is this thing? A 145. And I completely ate it. Okay. I did not want to eat it. I wanted to leave it to die. Um, do we want to try and take on the snake? Maybe let's hop this way. And give us some power-ups real quick. Uh, let's go ahead and have you follow me, RG. Okay, RG. I may hope if I hit the right button. Because some the other day it took off for away from me. Um, let's go ahead and put some levels on here. Oh, we got six. So let's definitely put some levels, get you up to 2,000. Oh, I guess we don't have enough. Um, cause they, and then we'll put some melee damage in. Let's fight a couple more of these things. There we go. Oh, here comes another one. Why is something's wrong? Okay. Because, like, something's wrong. I can't turn the frog. But now, must have just been a little glitch or something. So we got more levels now. So now let's put them. Get one more there, and then melee damage. We already have a, quite a bit of melee damage. Quite surprising. Need to get some weight on this thing too, because I'm going to run out of weight so fast on this. Now, where'd the snake go? Where'd the snake? Like, I need to turn my stuff off too. My brightness and everything. There it is. Got it. Got the snake. That was pretty easy too. Ooh, there's a sark over there. Come on, I want to get some cementing paste. Well, I'll probably fly, not fly around, uh, cruise around here, see if I can get some cementing paste. And then I'll be back at base to return the frog there. And then we'll go off finding the anklo. So I'm just going to hop around here for a little bit, like I said, see if I can find anything. And once I get back to the base and get ready to go get the anklo, I will see you again. So, hasta la vista. Come back here or not so I'll see you then okay so I made it back to base finally with the frog and I did get some extra uh, or not some extra but some cementing paste not a whole lot I did find a couple groupings so as you can see I got all that cementing paste there which of course is always good to have a bunch um, let's go ahead and power us up maybe add some stamina but we got the frog there and then I got a monkey on my shoulder as you can see it there which I'll throw off here in a second I'll just kind of stick the frog I'll just stick it in here with the parasaur for now and we got the monkey here oh it's right there we I named it Coco so it's like Coco the gorilla but a monkey it's a little female she was a level 90 I believe oops I want to throw it out there so I can let give her some health going on here so yeah, so I tamed her up. It was um, when I was hopping around trying to find some of the frog, just kind of hopping in different areas. I found a couple of these little mesopithecuses or the little monkeys. And so I decided to tame one up since I was out. And so I tamed that up. Let's see if you have, it is on the feeding trough though. So it should be fine. Oh, of course. Yeah, it's got all the meat on it there. Okay, so now it's time. Just want to kind of give that little update of uh, taming the monkey and then now, or and then the frog as well so now it's time to find an anklo so I gotta figure out where the anklos are so I will figure that out real quick where to look for them because I tried in the snow but that didn't turn out so well last time so I'll try and find a thing or something that tells where you can like find uh, de the dinos at or whatever and I'm going to tame an anklo so I will find wherever that is and I'll bring it back once I find one to actually tame up so I'll see you then
So I finally found an Anki. I was been flying around for a good 30 minutes now and I found one up on the mountain there and it's actually warm enough now that I can actually fly or fly up into the mountain area and not like die from the freezing. Oh shoot, no. No. Follow me, not the not the I forgot I had it set on follow the frog. And so I tried to fly back to the frog. Okay. So let's land you down here. And don't go anywhere. So now we're all good. Okay, so now we get to tame up. I do have all the, yeah, I do have all the walls placed. This is one I used to tame up the deer, or whatever it's called, Megaloceros. And so now I can use it to fight this. I, since I wasn't far from the base, like I said, it was up on that snow mountain over there. By that bridge, up a little bit ways into the mountains where I found this. And it's a 135. The highest I could find, aside from this, was 60. So I was about to just have to fly somewhere else because I flew um, all over this area over here. Came across a couple griffins, which would have been cool to tame. But um, just trying to find Anki. And so I just kept flying over, flew over to the um, snow area and stuff because I have seen them in the snow before. And I found a whole bunch, but like I said, all of them, like the highest I could find was a 60. And I was like, I want something higher than a 60. So I just kept flying around and eventually found this 135 female. So now we are taming her up. And I was just going to fly it back to my base. But then I was like, I wonder if this uh, little shelter or taming box is still over here. And I flew over here and it was. So now I'm just trying to get this Anklo knocked out. And Kylo If it would just go to sleep. That would be perfect. Go to sleep right in the butt. Right in the butt hole. Go to sleep. Take a nap. It's your nap time. It's like fine with a little kid trying to get him to go to sleep. Go to sleep. Come on. Get knocked out. Waste all my train darts. Ugh. Almost there. And hopefully I don't shoot it when it goes down this time. Like I did the frog. I think Yankees look so cool. I like their hard shells. I used to have, when I was real little and was super in the dinosaurs and everything. Which of course I still like dinosaurs but not nearly as much. Um, I used to have an Anklo little toy that I always played with all the time. It was like a big dinosaur. It's probably like a foot long all together and I had a T-Rex to go with it. I just have them fight all the time and I loved it so much and so I just like Ankies a lot because of that. So now I'm gonna get this tamed up and so once it's tamed we will be done. I wonder what I saw a uh, whatever roly-poly guy Dodicarus over here and I wondered what level it was. I was gonna check it out but I'm gonna let this tame up and if I see anything else around here that I think is cool I'll tame it up as well in the meantime but I will see you when it gets done tame it up okay so the Anki got tamed up but I'm gonna be leaving that right now for a second actually let's come back over here because I did tame up a bear so I'm going to take oh, I'll probably need a lot more berries than that um, just leave you here like that but there was a bear wandering around over here and I've really wanted a bear so I was like I'm just gonna try and tame it since I'm up on the rock and everything and so I finally got it tamed it, it took almost uh, oh, probably half my darts. It took a crap ton of darts. I don't know if it takes berries or meat. We do have both that we can try because obviously we have meat on the RG here. Yeah, no, uh, whatever, prime meat. So let's go ahead and take normal meat as well. It's not the best level. Wait, level 15? Okay, this is not the bear I was taming because I lost track of the one I was taming. So I just assumed this one was it. But, because it, it was like an 85 or something, and this is a level 15. So that is not good at all. Let's see if I can find the bear I was after. Yep, level 85 bear, and it's all bloody, as you can see. Well, I guess we'll stick with our 15, and then once I get more advanced in technology and all sorts of stuff, and I broke my gun, as you can see, probably there on the hotbar. Um, but once I get more advanced in technology, we'll find a different bear. Because as I said, I've never had one and I've always wanted one really bad. So I'm going to tame one up now. And so apparently this bear spawned since I ran out the other one. So I thought this was the same bear and it just turned around and ran the other way. 
Well, let's tame it up. Let's see what's it eating. Looks probably like meat is what it's been eating. Well, hopefully the bear will tame up here in a second. Let's go ahead and hit a rock here just to see how much stuff we get with the Anki. Because I need it for flint. 400 and something. Wow. And we got some metal too. That's awesome. Okay. So I definitely have to clear some of this for stone and stuff off. But I finally got an Anki tame and there's our dire bear as well. I have no clue what to call it. And it's such a low level. But let's see if I can do a dire bear. And it, ooh, it can be crafted. I think I have the cemini paste on me. Oh. Nope, I don't have enough cemini paste. Dang it. Okay. Well, we are going to be... Hopefully the bear will follow. I read my bird finally gave it the name of Astro. I was trying to come up with something since it has a red head. Something related to that, but I couldn't think of anything. But we'll just have to go with it. So let's go with dire bear following. And I can pick up the anki. Let's go, Dire Bear. And we're into our base now. Awesome, awesome. We'll just drop these off over here and I'll go ahead and. Let's go ahead and why the. Oh, shoot. Well, why? There we go. Now let's go shut the door real quick. I thought I. And I'm set to automatically close. I must not have. Oh well. And close. Okay. Now we gotta craft the bear saddle, which I should be able to come down over here and just craft up the saddle real quick. So we can play with the bear. Okay. Go in here, saddles, somewhere right there, saddles, and where is it? Oh, I thought you could craft them in here. Oh well, I'll just grab some cementy paste. And then what else did I need? Hide. Hide nor here. Oh, apparently we need a lot of hide. Any more? Hide. Nope. I know that RG should have hide on it. Come on. Enough. There we go. And we got the bear saddle. So let's spit this cementy paste back in here. There we go. Now to the bear. So we got a bear in our inky now. That's so cool. Like I said, the bear's going to be kind of crappy since it was a level 18. But let's put the saddle on the bear and see what this baby can do. Let's go ahead and add a bunch of health and weight to it. How are you waving? You little bear? Oh, can do a swipe. Swipe or no swiping. Oh, gather berries. What else do we do? So we do a bite. Looks like, um, oh, it just does a little growl type thing. Nope, that's the wrong button. So yeah, it looks like that's pretty much all it does. We can just go around and just swipe at stuff, gather some berries, which is cool. I don't know compared to, it looks like it does get more fiber though. Um, I don't know compared to the uh, trike. I'm sure there's some sort of study out there of which one gets more. And then of course, let's hit our little ankle on here. There we go, we got tons of flint. Ooh, we've got some metal. Of course, this can um, harvest metal, which is also cool. So we are just all set up now on dino, so we definitely need to get more weight pumped on here. Yeah, get over 2,000 for right now. And then, of course, we'll need to put in some movement speed because this thing moves so slow. But that I think that's probably going to be it for the day. Of course, we got an ankle, which I wanted. Got a frog, which I wanted. And then we got a bear and a monkey. Come on, which we were not planning on, but we got anyways. So that's really cool. Got the monkey there on my shoulder. Let's see if we can. Oh, can't get any closer. But he's there on my shoulder. So I hope you enjoyed this taming episode of Ark. We got a couple new dinos, as I mentioned, so we can help get some advancements going with some mini pace and everything. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe to see more videos. And we'll see you next time.